Music is fun. True. Sometimes it's funny and exciting. Like when Sapplers came, when Grand Wizard Theodore did the first scratch, when Sean Fanning made Napster. Well, sometimes it's not so funny. The induced act could soon make any culture making device with the potential for copyright infringement illegal. Recently, the court decided that NWA had no right to freely sample a three second riff from Get Off Your Ass and Jam by George Clinton and Funkadelic. The court said If you cannot pirate the whole sound recording, can you lift or sample something less? Our answer is in the negative. We say. If the smallest bits crumble, the hole might tumble down as well. And the Attorney General said, I don't think we have a public domain attitude. And little did he know that one day indeed we would have no culture whatsoever. How do I know this? I am Manfred the Great, transgalactic time traveler, granted the license to freely sample from Future's Alternative by a freak accident. I will now bring you Musics of the Future. <laughs> there is a future that's silent and even the heartbeat is copyrighted. There is a future in which recording devices are extinct. Music is played but never stays around for long. There is a future that unravels to a bland soundtrack of corporate pop. And there is a future surprisingly familiar, where bits of Elvis or Janice echo in futuristic compositions. Now is tomorrow's past. Remixers of the future Await beautiful songs of today. We've got the music of our ancestors to enjoy. What music will you leave for your grandchildren? Grand grandchildren? Grand grand grandchildren? Grand grand grandchildren? Grand 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 grandchildren? Grand 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 grandchildren? Grand 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 grandchildren? Grand 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 grandchildren?